So uh, this is uh, week two, evaluating ethics of marketing practices. And it says indicate whether you consider each of the following actions ethical, unethical, or a gray area. Which of the actions would you do? Which would you feel comfortable doing? And which would you refuse to do? Um, starting with number one, I, uh, in my opinion, I put it as ethical. It has good benefits by keeping citizens out of the house and staying active. I got ethical because it keeps people like active doing stuff. Like, as he said, out of the house doing stuff. Uh, I put this app would be unethical, and that's just because of the repercussions on it. Like in terms of uh, it encouraging people to take unnecessary risks and climbing trees. Uh, yeah. And I would say it's a gray area because it is a good thing for people to be out of the house and be active, but at the same time, they don't have to go climb a tree or navigate a cliff if they don't want to. Right. And uh, for question two, I put it, I find it as ethical. Uh, he's your client and you want him to know the most information as possible, but if the client doesn't want to invest, then that's their decision. But it is, it is nice to give him an idea if he wants to learn more than he can, if he wants to spend the money. I feel I was in the gray area, gray area on that one because like it is, it is good to buy like nice and nice stuff, but like at the same time you don't have to at the same time. So like, I was really in the middle on that. Um, I put this ethical because uh, with it being nice to know, it's better to need it and uh, it's better to have it and not need it than to need the information and not have it. So. I put it as ethical. Yeah. yeah, I put ethical because the client could find something new that even you didn't know. So it could be nice to find something new. Uh, for number three, uh, I decided to put unethical um, because you failed to prepare for the workload and just dumping the project off to someone else is kind of messed up, especially when others in a workplace are relying on you to do your job. Um, so that was just my opinion on that. I put unethical because uh, if the client was waiting on you to work on the research, giving it to somebody else, like, that's kind of bad on you because like, especially the client was looking forward to that. So I put unethical. Uh, for number three, I put unethical because uh, you should do your job and satisfy the customer. If somebody looking for you to get a job done and you just hand it off to somebody else and they have a certain expectation, then they might not get done the way it's supposed to get done. Yeah, I also put unethical because you shouldn't. You should be able to know how much of a workload you have before accepting your business. Uh, and uh, for question four, I put uh, it was unethical, and I said there's a time and a place with friends to talk and look at, at women, but it should not be in a work environment. And I, I, I put unethical too because like that's a little childish. As a story manager, you should like experience and stuff like that. So I put unethical. On that. Uh, for number four, I put an ethical because, um, like they said, for me, it's the workplace it's supposed to be a professional scene, so you shouldn't be checking out girls while you're at work. Yeah, I also put an ethical because it's an unprofessional to have these rules in a store. Uh, for number five, I put uh, it's ethical, and I, my uh, only reasoning behind that is just like the world's always changing. Uh, the way we talk, the way we uh, do things is a lot different than what it was 50 years ago, even 20 years ago. So I just think that most people, um, especially if it's for a, a popular theme park in Florida, you're mostly going to have a young group of kids anyway that are trying to apply, that are trying to work there. So I feel like for the most part, they probably understand what they're saying, and if not, then they just have to kind of get with the program, I believe. So, I put it in the gray area on that one because... At some theme park, there are older people that work, and not most older people keep up with stuff like that. But as they're saying, they should keep up the keep up to date on stuff like that, like new stuff, because the world is evolving. So I was really fifty fifty on that. I was really on that. <clears throat> For number five, I put ethical because no matter your the age you have to stay updated with the changes of the world and new technical technological innovations yeah i also put ethical because you should be able to keep up to date with all the new stuff because even if it's still gonna in the future everything's still gonna be improving and evolving